Living in the shadow of a famous sibling isn't easy, just ask Jeb Bush. At Hyundai, the Ionic 5 and Ionic 6 have been soaking up the spotlight, earning back-to-back -back EV of the Year awards and numerous other accolades. But not all of Hyundai's EVs have enjoyed the same recognition. The original Ionic EV, now discontinued, never received much attention, proving that being first doesn't always guarantee success. The Kona Electric, too, hasn't risen to stardom. The Kona Electric made its debut in 2019, a year after the gas-powered subcompact SUV hit the market, but buyers remained more drawn to the traditional model. Now, as the 2024 Kona enters its second generation, both the gas and electric versions sport a fresh design and a few upgrades, though we're not expecting the Kona Electric to become a household name in the EV world. Hyundai has given the styling a boost for both versions, featuring a sleek, blanked-off front fascia with a full-width light bar that is mirrored at the rear. The 2024 Kona is also larger than before, with the gas version growing by 5.7 inches in length, the electric by 5.9 inches, and both versions expanding by an inch in width and 2.3 inches in wheelbase. This shift takes the Kona from being one of the smallest in its class to one of the largest. The added size translates to a significantly roomier interior. Rear passengers gain an additional 3.0 inches of legroom and benefit from a flat floor, decent headroom, and comfortable seating. However, narrow door openings still pose a challenge for easy access. The cargo space has also increased by 7 cubic feet, making the new Kona more practical than ever. The cabin of the new Kona Electric now features side-by-side 12.3-inch digital displays, similar to those found in Hyundai's higher-end models. The controls are mostly physical buttons, steering clear of the touch-sensitive interfaces that often cause frustration. While novelty shifters can be tricky, the Kona Electric's column-mounted twist flipper is easy to get used to. There's ample storage throughout the cabin, including plenty of space in the center console and a tray on the dashboard in front of the passenger. However, much of the interior is made from hard plastic. For 2024, the Kona Electric offers two powertrains, a new 133 horsepower base motor and a 201 horsepower option, both with front wheel drive. We tested the 201 horsepower version, which provides sufficient speed for city driving. However, those expecting muscle car-like acceleration from an EV may be underwhelmed. In our tests, the Kona Electric reached 60 miles per hour in 7.0 seconds and completed the quarter mile in 15.5 seconds at 93 miles per hour. These figures are slightly slower than the previous generation Kona EV, which, being 98 pounds lighter, hit 60 miles per hour 0.6 seconds faster and finished the quarter mile half a second quicker buyers will likely focus more on the vehicle's range. The 2024 Kona Electric, equipped with a 64.8 kWh battery, has an EPA-estimated range of 261 miles, an improvement over the previous model's 258 miles with a similarly-sized battery. In our 75 miles per hour highway range test, the Kona Electric achieved a solid 230 miles. However, it's important to note that the base SE model comes with a smaller 48.6 kWh battery, offering an EPA-estimated range of just 200 miles. While the Kona Electric doesn't share the 800-volt architecture of its more premium siblings, which allows for faster charging, it has seen some improvements. Its 400-volt system now supports charging speeds of up to 100 kW at a DC fast charger. Additionally, the onboard Level 2 charger has been upgraded from a 7.2 kW unit to a 10.8 kW unit, reducing the time to charge from 10 to 100% at a 240 volt source by a third, now taking 6 hours and 5 minutes, according to Hyundai. The Kona Electric isn't at the level of the Ionic 5 and 6, but it's still a pleasant EV. The chassis is also well sorted for an in-town runabout, albeit with a fair bit of lean in the corners. The steering has some artificially added weight. It doesn't change with cornering forces, but the effort levels are fine. The Kona Electric's braking should please drivers no matter where they fall on the regenerative braking spectrum. Paddles allow you to adjust the level of liftoff regen from none, full coasting, to one pedal driving, I pedal, with several steps in between. And those who do use the brake pedal will find predictable modulation. Stopping distances from 70 miles per hour, however, were a longish 179 feet, 
which is 6 feet worse than we recorded with the previous Kona Electric. We tested the Limited, which is generously equipped with heated and ventilated front seats, a heated steering wheel, Hyundai's blind spot monitor, a 360-degree view camera system, key fob, operated remote parking, and digital key. At $42,650 as tested, though, a wandering eye looks longingly across the showroom at the Ionic 5 for less than $1,000 more or the Ionic 6 SE Long Range for $43,600. Perhaps, then, you drop down to the Kona Electric SEL, which starts at $38,070. We'd avoid the entry-level SE, $34,070, with its smaller battery and shorter range. At the high end, though, we'd be more tempted by one of the Kona Electric Superstar siblings. 2024 Hyundai Kona Electric, a bold design statement. The 2024 Hyundai Kona Electric represents a significant departure from its predecessor in terms of design. It's a bolder, more futuristic, and visually striking SUV. Exterior design. Pixelated lighting. The most distinctive feature is the pixelated lighting design, both for the headlights and taillights. This gives the Kona Electric a unique and modern look. Sharper lines. The overall silhouette is more angular and athletic compared to the softer curves of the previous generation. Increased size. The Kona Electric has grown in dimensions, resulting in a more imposing stance. Interior Design Techcentric Cabin The interior is driver-focused with a strong emphasis on technology. A large, high-resolution infotainment screen dominates the dashboard. Modern Aesthetics The use of high-quality materials and a clean, minimalist design creates a premium feel. Practicality Despite the focus on style, the Kona Electric doesn't compromise on practicality. There's ample storage space and comfortable seating. The 2024 Hyundai Kona Electric offers a solid, if not exhilarating, performance. While it's not designed to be a speed demon, it provides adequate power for most driving conditions. Here's a breakdown of its performance characteristics. Electric motor. The Kona Electric is equipped with a single electric motor that delivers instant torque, providing a smooth and responsive driving experience. Acceleration. While it's not as quick as some of its competitors, the Kona Electric offers respectable acceleration for daily commuting and highway merging. Handling. The Kona Electric boasts a well-balanced chassis, offering good handling and stability. It feels confident and composed around corners. Ride comfort. The suspension is tuned for comfort, absorbing road imperfections effectively. The cabin remains quiet, contributing to a pleasant driving experience.